Well, talking about the free agents, I mean, there's not going to be much time before camp starts up. Right. What is that going to be like? It's going to be simultaneous. I mean, there'll be undrafted free agents hopefully earlier, but then the un the unrestricted free agents. I mean, we're going to be bringing guys in. We might be in the middle of practice, so we'll see what happens, what the rules are. We don't know from the league yet, but we're excited about this opportunity to get John Fox and, and his his coaches out there with the players and you know get the team going. So we're uh, we're hoping for the this season. And do you think that this, the Broncos are ready to hit the ground running? Yes, I, I think we'll be ready. I think there'll be 40 to 50 days of, of preparation before the Raiders game on Monday Night Football. So we're excited. I mean, this is a, a very experienced staff, and we have good players, and, and we just can't wait to uh, get everybody together and end this lockout, and, and hopefully they can get it done this week. And you also only played one year of college football. How is it coming so easily to you? Uh, it's not coming easy at all. <laughs> um, every day is a struggle out there to, to try to be uh, the best player I can be for my teammates. Um, I mess things up every day and I have to go back in, review it, and try to be better the next day. So it's definitely uh, not been easy, but fortunately enough, I've been able to make some plays for the team. And, um, you know, that's helping uh, the coaches and uh, the other players alike build confidence and the things that I can do for this football team. And, you know, that's, a, that's huge for a rookie. And uh, I hope I can just continue doing what I can to, to make plays. And yesterday, quarterback Hal Wharton had some really great comments about you. He said you basically catch everything he throws at you. Um, it's nice that he can throw early because he knows he just puts the ball up and you can get it because you've got great hands. What does that mean to you to hear those compliments? Oh, that means I must be uh, doing a good job of making sure he has everything he needs <laughs> around the facility. <laughs> But no, um, that's that's a, a great compliment coming from a starting quarterback for me, just to know that he has confidence and my ability to make plays also lets me know that you know he's going to look for me. And um, at any receiving position, when you know the quarterback's looking for you, that's a, that's a great thing to have in the back of your mind when you're going into a route. And you know, I hope I can just continue to make plays and he'll continue to trust me more and more with football. What are some of your personal goals that you've kind of set, either you know, for the team or individually? My, my first personal goal is to have a perfect practice. After I can get past that perfect practice, then I'll move on to the next one. So how's training camp going? For uh, you? Training camp's going really well. Um, we got a lot of tight ends, but we're all good and we're all fighting hard. So uh, it's it's a good competition. Yeah, how do you feel about that bringing them bringing in a lot of competition for for you personally? Uh, I mean, it, it's, it's a lot of there. Are, um, a lot of good guys at the position, and it's going to be the same thing every year. You just got to keep on fighting for a job, and got to play good. Um, if you're not going to make the team here, you got to play good on film, so another team will pick you up. And what are you doing to make yourself stand out to the coaches? Um, just trying to do everything, being all around tight end, uh, learn the whole offense, whether it be receiving concepts, um, fullback stuff, and uh, just doing what I can on special teams also.